think the most fascinating thing being here is just the fact that a whole community like this can exist with really limited access to uh, you know the rest of the world. You drive in, you come on a main road, that road turns into a smaller road and eventually you're you're on something that honestly is really difficult to walk. And then when you arrive, there's a school, you know, there's, it's almost, it's, I mean, it is a town. It's a whole community here, you know, to our eyes is completely cut off, but to theirs it's not. This community have a huge necessity. When the river is high, they just cannot cross. And the kids get stuck, the old people get stuck. The old people, if they need to go to the hospital, they get stuck over there. So we saw a huge need in this community and we asked them if they wanted a bridge because they need to be able to work with us. So they say yes, you guys say yes, and we are here. Seeing the response from the community, so many people coming out each day and seeing the impact that it will have on them and seeing them get involved, those expectations have definitely been met, seeing that they're so happy to have it, and just seeing the need. We watch young school children cross the river in their school clothes every day, you know, and we've been told in, in rainy season they just can't go to school because they can't get across the river. You guys have the perfect combination. You guys have the right boss, the right team, just everything works so, so smooth. The place is, is absolutely stunning. It really is, it really is the rainforest. You know, they cut all of the lumber for the deck um, out, out in the jungle and carried it on their backs here. It's, it's really, really cool to see. Maria, our program manager, she overheard some girls commenting, um, saying how impressed they were that there were three women up on the scaffolding. Um, and that they thought that was only um, something that, that guys can do. So the fact that, that we showed these young girls that they can do anything that the guys can do, I think that was absolutely my, my favorite part. To be here with um, these people and to be here in their just like their everyday environment and really experiencing life with them has been really mind blowing to take you back of all the extra things you have, and really, how many of those things do you really need? Because they live such a simple, basic life. And obviously it's so great that we could add some infrastructure to that life. I build bridges for a living, and, and uh, we build them for people, but this is more personal. These, these people have uh, gained a lot from it. It's hard to describe the feeling of knowing that you were a part of that and you were able to give that to a large community of people. I do this type of work because I honestly love work with the community and feel like my work make an impact in the people.